I'm recording this video to show support for Pete and his family and to express our gratitude for waking us up to the law. Just yesterday I had to review IRS Publication 2105 and it says plain and simple, know the law. You can't get much clearer than that. I've seen several t-shirts on Facebook recently that I think are very appropriate to our struggle. First, God Almighty gave his archangels weapons because the Lord knows you don't fight evil with tolerance and understanding. I believe the Lord brought us Pete for just this reason, to give us more tools with which to fight evil. Next, deplorable. We're not asking for our country back, we're taking our country back. And I added one 1040 submission at a time. Now, our family has not had a victory yet, and we're still fighting over 2012, 13, 14, 15, and 16. We have had the IRS admit that we only owed $843 for 2014, but when I responded that we wanted the entire refund back, they said, that's frivolous, and we're off again to the races. We also had a letter proposing a 75% return of our demanded refund for 2016, which was responded to in the same manner. Haven't heard a decision yet, only we'll get back to you. Since I'm a retired military officer, the Atlanta IRS office is going after a portion of my retired pay. Have to do some more research there, but since I have duly paid all required federal taxes and the IRS steadfastly refuses to provide a competing claim, I think we will win in the end, but I do foresee more difficulties ahead. I hope to report back soon that we have won at least one year's return in 2018. In the meantime, the interest bearing against the IRS continues to build. It's more than we would get back in a savings account, I suspect. So, from our family to all of yours, we hope you have a very Merry Christmas, and may God bless your friends and family in the new year.